good afternoon students welcome back in this video we are going to discuss about how are we going to do the exercises what is the procedure and what do we have to do with it according to the question according to the book the question says complete these sentences by adding adverbs you have to complete these sentences by adding an adverb okay that is what the question is demanding from you all and you have already studied about the different types of adverbs the position of adverbs and how do we frame how do we form the adverbs okay so today i have written two examples from exercise a okay that is already posted in your whatsapp the first sentence says the stranger opened the door okay you have to finish this sentence using an adverb and the meaning of that adverb is already given in the bracket the meaning of the adverb that has to be filled there the meaning of it is without making noise so without making noise stands for the adverb silently okay so what you are going to write over here the stranger opened the door silently okay silently the next question some of the class did their work again you have to do the same thing the meaning is already given without taking care taking care means uh carefully but without taking care carelessly okay so this is for exercise a this is how you are going to do exercise a now come to exercise b exercise b tells you in each of the sentences take the adverb phrase at the end and place them at the beginning meaning whatever adverb phrase is given to you in the end you have to bring it in the front position example the first sentence we started our journey in the morning here the adverb phrase that is given to you in italics is underlined over here in the morning okay now that has to come at the beginning of the sentence so when it comes at the beginning of the sentence your answer is in the morning we started our journey question number 2 we had reached madras by noon by noon is your adverb phrase that has to come at the beginning of the sentence now when we bring it to the beginning it becomes by noon we had reached madras question number 3 we went home afterwards here afterwards is your adverb phrase so your answer becomes afterwards we went home now in exercise c you have to add the adverbs in brackets to these sentences now before doing this exercise you should prefer to the position of different types of adverbs what i taught you all with the position of different types of adverbs if you go through that video it is clearly explained where and how do we place the adverbs with different types so first sentence my brother and i cycled to school together my brother and i cycled to school together and we have to use the adverb of frequency often okay and where do we use often we use it in the mid position between the subject and the verb so often will come in between my brother and i often between my brother and i and cycle the subject and the verb okay it will be present in between i and cycle so your answer will be my brother and i often cycle to school together question number 2 we have seen such a strange sight we have seen adverb of perception okay whenever we see a perception we use it with the verb okay we have never seen such a strange sight we have never 
see such a strange sign. When the object is longer, we generally use it in with the helping verb. That is have. Question number three. He tells the truth. We have already seen that where do we use always, ever, and never. Always, never goes in the first position. So always will be after the subject. He always tells the truth. He always tells the truth. So this is how you are going to do all these three exercises. If you have any doubts with it, please ask me on my WhatsApp. Okay? Thank you.